Hey boys, Brett Legger from Lovely Grind here. Today we're looking at the repeat session of squats. So three sets of three at 215 kilos. Now this is what I was supposed to do last week, but uh, completely bombed on that session, you know, due to the not organizing my time properly and uh, just feeling pretty dodgy about the whole thing. So I came back the following week, which is this week, and squatted on the Monday night when there was people around me, people to encourage people to operate and spot the uh, the lift so operate the lift operate the monolift and spot the lift so this session was much much better than last week's I nearly completed the whole thing I only missed the last rep which was just too much for me so the last set was a double but I'm not really that upset about it I mean 215 for three sets of three at uh, 83 kilos is quite good I think it's it's quite a big PB for me and I'm really hoping it puts me at uh, a one rep max of about 237 or 240 so not the following week the week after that is when I'll test it been thinking a bit lately that I'm gonna have to bring my my feet in which is probably not all that common in powerlifting I know it's more of a, an Olympic lifting things to have a, a nice uh, narrow stance but I find that my knee tracks so much better when I've got a narrow stance compared to my, my wide stance, my knees don't really stay over my heels and my, my glutes don't activate properly. Whereas the safety bar squats that I did this week, I actually brought my stance in and I was able to track my knees outside of my heels the whole time and get way, way more quad and glute activation. And I just felt like it was better overall. So I'm gonna start doing that, gonna start bringing my stance in and uh, hopefully my knees track better, my quads and my glutes activate better and the lift is just better. <laughs> So the safety bar squats, five sets of three at 170 kilos. I already mentioned previously that I narrowed my stance for the last couple of sets, which really, really helped. Unfortunately, I didn't get footage of that, so we just got the normal stance that you're watching here. But I think they moved really, really well, and I didn't really have any problems at all with it. And I mean, I've never done 170 for five sets of three at safety bar, so I'm very, very happy with that. So after that, I did some penle rows, 120 kilos for four sets of six. I always recommend people do the, the heavy penles. I think it's great for building up that back strength. So Friday, it's my birthday. So this session, I was really, really, really pumped up because it was my birthday and I got up, the first thing I did was go to the gym and just smash out these deadlifts. There's, <laughs> I was just on a whole new level of uh, amped up and the adrenaline was flowing. And I pretty much thought I was like the toughest guy ever because I put myself in that mindset and it made the session a lot easier, honestly, when you can kind of shift your mind. And <laughs> that is exactly what happened this session. You can see at the start of the video, I had uh, a montage of me throwing down all the deadlifts and I was just listening to the songs and had these lyrics in my head and I'm just like, yeah, like I'm so tough. But that, uh, that session went really well. That was five by five at 187.5 kilos. Pretty sure I've done 200 kilos for five by five. So this is not a PB by any stretch of the imagination, but it did move fairly well. And the only thing again that I have to uh, remember to do is keep my neck neutral. So she's all a work in progress, but I was pretty happy with how that session went. Obviously, um, getting that pumped up and getting the adrenaline flowing did make the lifts a lot easier. Once I start entering the triples with squats, I just um, I just tend to, to ease off all of the accessories. I'll still do like a push workout at um, the any Anytime Fitness, you know, with machines and like uh, overhead press and stuff like that. Just because I like um, just because I like getting a pump, really. So that's it from me, guys. Like, subscribe, all that bullshit. Together, we can become something more than we ever thought we could be. I'm Brett Leggett, and I'm out. I'll see you guys next time. You can apply that to any, any area of life. You, know, you do the work, you have it, guys. you don't want to do, you achieve the dream you're ever going to see. I mean, it literally kills stuff. To achieve so the 